Somewhere in California, there's a man who only answers to the name Maestro, who, with the power of his martial arts, claims to be able to strike down his opponents without touching them. So this is like chi? No, it's based on real, real things like numerology, astrology, sacred geometry. I've noticed in your demonstrations that your students never have a weapon. Yes, well it's because uh, in the past when we were training, it, it, the energy I was projecting was just too much. So here's a few examples of what happened when my students tried to parry my techniques. So we were breaking this poor sword, you can see it's just, it's actually missing a ring now. And well, it's just, so the energy is just too much for the weapons to take. So we're, um, uh, it just, we just, we can't afford to keep breaking all of our swords. Unfortunately, this interview was cut short by the global pandemic. We were able to contact the maestro eight months later. We sent him a camera and more questions. This thing, how does this work? I don't understand. Why do we have to know? Ah, there, oh, there we are. Great. Okay. Good. Now then. Okay. So here is our setup. It's just a pad with the cone helping hold it up, just like that. So, so yes, during this lockdown situation, we are um, able to, or I should say I am able to uh, practice even more now um, than I was in the past. Uh, more time on my hands and such, and I've grown in skills and, and, and need I say, powers. Um, <clears throat> I can uh, um, um, we'll manipulate all kinds of things, which we we, we, we gave you some video of. Hopefully it, uh, yes. Anyway. So does this always work? Uh, no, unfortunately there's some ways that people can kind of counter these things. For instance, like if your tongue is touching the roof of your mouth or your little toe on your right foot is sticking up off the ground, uh, the techniques sometimes don't work. So very, very interesting. Why would that af affect the technique? You see it disrupts the ley lines of the thermal goetic energy that I'm trying to send across the room. This is a 500 pound bed. So, 500 pound bed. Through energetic transferness, transferness of my power, I will send it through this bag, undamaged. What few people know is that in a past life, I was a student of Dardi, uh, who is a very famous uh, uh, maestro from Italy. Um, I was actually a senior student of Marozzo, uh, little, little Moro. Yes, he was such a scamp. Um, that's what we called him, Little Moro. Demonstration of my defensive prowess. So do you always need to use a weapon for these demonstrations and techniques? Uh, no. Um, in the beginning, definitely. The, the weapon helps me focus this energy that I'm, I'm sending across to my opponent. Uh, but as you get better, you don't need the weapon anymore because your body's a weapon. My head is like a mace. My leg is like a halberd. My arm is a sword. My fingers are like daggers or knives. Wait for it. 